Hello everyone, my name is Robbie Connect and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you my Notion and how I track habits. Three things before I show you my Notion is number one, we are moist robots. Number two is habits are the software to our programming. Moist Robots was coined by Scott Adams, the Dilbert comic, um, or Dilbert comedian, I think you could, the Dilbert cartoonist, that's what I'm looking for. Um, another way to think about us is uh, that we are just organic, organic machines. We just repeat habits throughout the day. How you brush your teeth, what leg you put in first when putting on a pair of pants, uh, enter some type of other action that you do throughout the day is a habit that you do repeat um, and habits are the software programming to to us the moist robots and the last thing to remember is so if you want to become a new person focus on building the habit that that new person would do um, you can look at examples of any other person that has something that you want, figure out what habits they do throughout the day and modify it to yourself and see and then just track from there basically. So three things to remember. We are moist robots, habits are the software, and we can write that code. Now let's dive into Notion and how I use Notion to track my habits. Along the similar lines of Scott Adams, he likes to talk about systems versus goals. So that's why I have system execution here. Systems are the things that you repeat that get you to your goals, but focus on the systems and not on the goal. You can achieve a system every single day. You can't really achieve a goal every single day. I don't know if I should phrase it that way, but I just did, so <laughs> accept it. At the top here, I have my January goals. Um, more of the vision and the direction that I want to head. Um, so those are all self-explanatory. Next, we have my table of system execution board. This is where I get to visually see the progression that, uh, that I'm making on the habits. Um, I'll talk about that briefly, but first I want to show you. So if you see each column, it's save, exercise, rest, notability, Spanish, breathe, caffeine-free, and affirmations. So how do I know when I can click and make a blue check mark for each of those? Well, down below, I have system details where I describe what can I do today. And if I do this today, then I can click and check a blue check mark. So for example, my saving system. If I don't purchase anything today, I can do a blue check mark. Exercise system. If I do pull-ups, stretching, squatting, or walking, any of those today, I can do my exercise system and then so on and so forth down the line. Why do this? Well, one, you visually can see the progression that you're, that you're making, and two, it's kind of rewarding to click and see that blue check mark pop up. If you scroll down to the bottom, you can see checked, checked four, 15, 15, 15, 11, 10, four, six, and that basically is just showing me another visual cue or a visual stat of how much more I have progressed um, since the start of this month. Anyways, this is how I use Notion to track my habits, my system execution. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Love you. Bye.